I think they somehow need to invent that you could include smell in the video. Crazy little fact, we're actually driving your car and I'm able to talk to you. And hopefully you can hear me. The little things in life. We just went to this really cool place. It's called... Uh, Adriatica. Adriatica, Adriatica. In Russian you would say Adriatica. This couple here from Texas went to Croatia and they were really inspired by architecture and surrounding. So they decided to come back to Texas and build something very similar. So we went to explore and it's really, really cool. You had those clay roofs and um, there's scripture everywhere, which was really encouraging. It was cool to see. This neighborhood had its own coffee shops and restaurants and shops, I believe, too. I don't know. Maybe they do have a grocery store. Maybe they don't. Maybe we're making this up. But coffee shop was definitely there Starbucks was there yeah it was a, a sushi few place it was a few restaurants there they have this cute little chapel where you can rent for weddings and a little bridal suite fortunately it was closed so we didn't get to see it inside anyway tonight supposed to be Haley you know how they say everything's bigger in Texas that is true the wind is bigger the weeds are bigger Today's supposed to be it's supposed to be hailing. I guess uh, what's the size supposed to be? Tennis ball. Tennis ball size. So if we catch that, then uh, we'll show you. If not, then it's better for us actually. Yeah. Because okay. I have to go and get extra insurance on this car, just in case. And right now we're going to get some real takes and barbecue. So y'all join us for dinner. I think they somehow need to invent that you could include smell in the video. <laughs> we got a booboo. But the smell of the smoke is just... Can't even tell. One pound of brisket, one pound of ribs, and then half a pound of sausage, and then half a pound of what? What else? These are my friends from Cleveland, Ohio. Sort of like moving around, like, like a rotisserie. How long does it take? Uh, 14, 16 hours. And, and they change different types of food, right? They put in one food. We are in Dallas, Texas, hanging out with some friends. Despite our troubles, we had the opportunity to be here and help out with this event it's been a lot of fun it's called easter open air this is an eight annual they had a few sponsors that you might see in the video overall it was a lot of fun we got to have some food which was flow i can't really tell you all the details in english but basically it's it's uzbek it's made in this cast iron pot that's made over the fire really really good if you ever have a chance try it
are at Fort Worth Stockyards. Just gonna go and see some cattle run. And I guess it's a must see if you're in Dallas Fort Worth area. Uh, I am in charge of six, seven, eight children. Some like that. My daughter's not feeling too good. And my husband is missing. That would be fun. Anyway, never seen cattle run before. This is the sight to behold. So we were getting tired of sitting in taxes, so we decided we need a trip. So we're going to Jacksonville, Florida. So we start driving, it's dark, and we needed to go to the bathroom. So I said, let's just pull over. This looks big enough. I believe there is 44 pumps over here to fill up. This is crazy. i never seen anything like that. And that store is Bucky's which I had no idea how you spelled that, but everybody was telling us that you really have to go check it out. So let's go see. You need a picture? Is he gonna eat you? A little too big. <laughs> I need more head. I think we should put those in front of our truck. I think we're all good to go. We've got some guns. We got brisket sandwich. Daria, what you got? Daria. Unicorn. You got a pink unicorn. We got uh, smokies and some jerky. So I think we're good to go. Yeah. Ooh, yeah, that's what we 